What is that? Is that a beast? A flying thing? What monster is that? I. Oh, it's a bat. Oh, sorry, I thought it was a manananggal. My mistake. Bats are so great. Wait, you're not so fond of them, are you? Well, until now, people think bats are still monsters. But to them, we are the monsters. Bat numbers are threatened from us hunting them and destroying their homes. Oh, oh yes. They fear us more than we fear them. So they hide. Places is the Cleopatra's Needle Critical Habitat, a protected area that showcases one of the oldest and most diverse forests in Palawan. Within the critical habitat is Olaongan Falls, where the bats would rest until the night falls, where they would do their responsibilities in peace. We thank bats for the life of the forest. They are noted pollinators, amazing seed dispersers, and efficient pest controllers. And we may see this phenomenon happen in one area, a place where most bats go, a concept known as species assemblage. We explored this concept by conducting a survey using harp traps and mist nets and had a total effort of 42 trap nights in 7 days. Captured bats were released after identification except for one individual per species which served as the voucher specimen. A broad habitat assessment was also done in the 5 sites. 12 individuals consisting of 5 species were found in only 2 sites. Site 3 and Site 5 Site 3 habitat characterized to be an ecotone was where the most species present were observed. The theropodids, Sinopterus brachiotis and Macroglossus minimus, were caught near fruiting trees due to their diet. Site 3 was alongside the river, allowing for a clear flight pathway that attracts gleaning insects, which was ideal to find the Marina suela, Rhinophilus arquatus, and the Caribola harwiki. With a mixture of agricultural and advanced secondary growth, Site 3 is believed to be a feeding ground for bats, which may explain the Chiropteran assemblage in the area. The insectivore Marinus willa was also seen in Site 5, a habitat we designated as an advanced secondary growth. Based on the research and in connection to the results of this study, we made an ecological niche diagram. Now you do understand, right? Bats are not so scary as many think. They have important jobs, they have families, they have pups. They need a place for them to nurture their young. Now you know about this amazing garden. Help us protect it. There are safe havens around called protected areas. Guard it. Share this story about the place where the wild bats go.